September 1st, 2018. Caitlin, today is our wedding day. I have always dreamed of this day and I wouldn't want to spend it with anybody else besides you. Austin, it is hard to believe our wedding day is finally here. Most of all, your dream come true. I thank God every single day for bringing you into my life and I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. It wasn't long after I met you that I knew I would marry you. You were that kind, sweet, Christian man that I had been searching my whole life to find. After meeting you just over three years ago, I knew you were the one for me and the person I would marry someday. Every day since then, we've grown closer and closer together and now finally into one. I know I have told you time and time again that you remind me of my grandpa and I am not sure if you can truly grasp what those words mean. Lastly, telling me that I resembled your grandpa Melvin in many ways and that it was almost too good to be true made me so happy. I know you've looked up to him and your grandma every day to be just like them. You've become just like that, a loving, caring, outgoing, hardworking, godly woman. I wish that I could have met him too. I know that he cannot be here today, but he's with us in our hearts. The last three and a half years have been more than I could have ever asked for. You have treated me better than I have ever been treated. You are so kind, compassionate toward me and towards others. I will continue to love you more and more every day from here on out. I remember every day that you have told me you are my person. And that I was the man you've been looking for in a husband to spend the rest of your life with. I cannot wait to call you my wife and to be by your side every day. Thank you for choosing me today and every day. From here on out, you are my world and my everything. I love you and you are my person. Now let's do this thing together. Your love. Austin. All my love, hey. Forever seems like a long time But nothing seems like a long time When I am with you I feel like I'm walking on water Since the day that I asked your father To let go of his daughter so give me your blessing, sir I'll give her all that I've got It doesn't look like much But it sure feels like a lot I never really know what love is But whatever it is I feel it in your kiss You walked in like somebody of this is to recognize that God says He is love. We're not God. So when we fail, it's really part of the design to say, it's okay. The love doesn't fail, and when I do, I get to say, okay, I'm wrong. Sorry. And then we start again. So love always perseveres, and because love always perseveres, it always hopes. 
and the boat sets things in front of us. And so we buy factors and build barns. We set alarm clocks to get us up in the morning because we expect the next day to happen, right? Love always hopes in what is yet to come. And because love always hopes, it means love always trusts and expects the best of each other and then trusts the best about each other. And so we, we do this thing where we, uh, we trust, even when there might be reasons not to, because, you know, we're not perfect, but then love always trusts. And because love always trusts, we go back to love always protects. Because those things that we protect are the things we wrap something around and we make sure something inside is safe and cared for. And so we put this wall around that thing that we love and care for between the world and it. Love always protects. And love rejoices in the truth and doesn't delight in the evil. So we rejoice in the truth and we do not delight in evil. And we don't keep a record of wrongs. And because there's no record of wrongs, love is not easily angry. We also are not doing these things. We're not going to be self-seeking. We're not going to be rude. We're not going to be proud. We're not going to boast. Because those things are all about me. So God's designed for love. And then he says, love is kind. And begins with love patient because there's always more yet you don't have to be upset about anything right now which takes us all the way back around love never fails so why do we have a chair with melvin present because melvin's here he's a part of the love that god designed right and so because love never fails we have the presence of those who love and god never fails so eternity is real. Well, at this point, I got not much left other than pronounce your husband and wife. Oh, you may kiss your bride. May I introduce for the first time ever Mr. and Mrs. Austin and Caitlin Durst. This is my love song to you. Let every woman know I'm yours So you can fall asleep each night, babe And know I'm dreaming of you more You're always hoping that we make it You always want to keep my gaze But you're the only one I see, love And that's the one thing that won't change I will never stop trying I will never stop watching as you leave I will never stop losing my breath Every time I see you looking back at me And I will never stop holding your hand I will never stop opening your door I will never stop choosing you, babe I will never get used to you This love song to you It's not a momentary face You are my life, I don't deserve you But you love me just the same And as the mirror says we're older I wanna look the other way You are my life, my love, my only And that's the one thing that won't change I will never stop trying I'll never stop watching as you leave I'll never stop losing my breath Every time I see you looking back at me And I'll never stop holding your hand I'll never stop opening your door I'll never stop choosing you, babe I'll never get used to 